Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? How's it going? It's me, Electra News, and I'm just playing in the rain like any normal child would. So now let's go to a bridge where it's all sunny and stuff. Alright. So today I got a battle with some guy on Cerebi. Didn't get to ask his name. Uh, he kind of, you know, exited out right before, I mean, right after the match. So yeah, you guys saw our teams. And let's just start this off. I start with Uzumaki, my Nine Tails. I get it, kind of an overplayed joke, but still. So I go for the dr drought, and then I go for a fire blast, and surprisingly that does not take out this thing, so it must be pretty bulky. So he uses dynamic punch, and that leaves me 47 health. So now he goes for a bullet punch, I'm like, I'm dead. But nope, live with 14 health. And I get past my confusion, use another fire blast, and that will be the end of Orfeo, which is the guy's name, right? Yeah. So now he sends out Spark Fire. And this time I go for Will-O-Wisp, and I miss, and then he just goes for a Thunderbolt, and that's a dead Ninetales right there. So now I send out Cubquake. I thought Cubquake was going to do some major damage here, so I go for a Superpower, predicting this Skarmory to come out, and guess what? It does about a fourth, so I'm, it's kind of sad. So, yeah, I was help, hurt with Rocky Hellman, now I switch out into Squidward, and he just sets up a spike, so I cannot let that happen, but... He just goes for a Brave Bird here, so Squidward just plain old dies, doesn't do anything in this match. It was a critical, but I don't think it mattered. But that Brave Bird did take a big chunk out of it. So now I go for Minato. I think he knew that I was going to use Focus Blast, so he switches into Dustnor, and that's exactly what I do. Focus Blast doesn't affect him, so I was sad. So I go for a Bug Buzz here. Does nothing, about a fifth, so I was sad. Willow is missed, so I'm like, okay, that's good. And he switches out Dustnor for Debugger, his Porygon 2. Um, I go for a Giga Drain, trying to get some health back. It does good, but it was a critical, so I was kind of sad about that. So I go for a Focus Blast here, and it still doesn't take him out. So he goes for a Toxic. Kind of had. Okay, so he goes for a Toxic here, and that will come back to bite me in the butt later. So he sends out Skarmory again, and I was... Just going to go for another Giga Drain, trying to get some more health back. Doesn't do too much. I lose some HP and some Poison. So I go for a Hidden Power Ice here, and that is able to take out Skarmory. So again, with the Life Orb and the Poison. So now, Dustnor. Dustnor is almost at full health, so I just go for a Giga Drain, trying to get some health back. Doesn't do too much. I get 127, then thing, and then Earthquake takes me down to 38. If I didn't Poison, I would have lived... But no, no. Oh well, Cupquake. So Cupquake goes for an Earthquake here. It does, uh, you know, a good chunk, I guess. But he uses Pain Split, and I'm like, oh my goodness, this Dustnor is so annoying. So I go for another Earthquake here, and it just goes for a Will-O-Wisp. So I know another Earthquake won't be able to take it out, which, you know, is not a good thing whatsoever. So he switches out Dustnor for Debugger. And Debugger just, you know, dies with from an Earthquake, I guess. I guess that's the only thing he... I guess he wanted to keep his Dustnor alive. So now Cloyster, or maybe just a free switch in with Cloyster. So I go for an Earthquake here, doesn't do too much. He goes for a Shell Smash, I was like, I cannot let this thing uh, set up on me. So please, Cupquake, just die so he doesn't set up. But no, 26 health and Ice Shard. I'm like, thank you for not setting up. Ooh, that would have been bad. So now I send out Camellia, my Lilligant... And in the sun, double speed, and I use Solar Beam, and that will be able to take out this Cloister. So, yeah. Now, Dustnor. I wasn't sure if I could kill it in one hit, so I use Sleep Powder here. It does work. And then I just go for a good old-fashioned Solar Beam. So I absorb the light and shazam! And that will kill Dustnor off. So now, Sparkfire. The, po the person's last Pokemon. So I go for another Sleep Powder here. And I just go for another Solar Beam. And that will still not be able to take this thing out. Which, you know, is not good at all. He uses Flamethrower in the Drought. It does, like, way more damage. And that is able to kill Camellia. I think it would have anyways, even if... But, whatever. Life Orb damage takes it to, like, one health. I use Bug Buzz here. I knew that the only thing that could happen was either I win or a tie with that Life Orb. But I win. Player defeated. Uh, good game. Bye.